This is how I put together the maps and graphics for the 5 o'clock report of the Weather Magician here. Hundreds are missing or stranded. Seven to many breaks joins us with much more. Amanda. Ryan, about 2,500 people were trapped and up to eight homes were ruined in the mudslides. Now crews are working to clear all the roads and make sure everyone is okay. Everything slides down and it's just this rush of like rock in water and mud. Torrential rain and deadly mudslides hit two Southern California towns, trapping campers. People are also missing. The rushing water caught up with drivers and left cars stranded. This helicopter footage shows the extent of the flooding. Emergency workers were forced to break the windows of this car to make sure no one was trapped inside. The mud flow left roads impassable, trapping 500 children and adults at a local church camp. Crews used bulldozers and other heavy equipment to try to reach the campers as air rescue crews worked to free residents and their beloved pets. This van was nearly completely submerged in mud on a campsite. I knew it was a flash flood. I knew we were in the middle of it. And we only had minutes to decide to turn around. Debris now litters the streets in this powerful water, knocking even this hot tub from its foundation. Some roads are covered with six to eight feet of rock as floodwaters continue to rush down hillsides and across roadways, making driving extremely difficult. Putting together the surface map by the country here. About 3 50 p.m. Eastern Daily Time weather map from the Weather Channel here. Right, right here. Some crews have been able to clear a few roads in the area, allowing I copied. Drivers to make it down that mountain. Cut from the Weather Channel website. President Obama turns 53 today. After a tense week in Washington, the president took some time to celebrate his birthday over the weekend. The commander-in-chief played golf on Saturday with three childhood friends. After golf, the president spent some time at Camp David before... And we're going to put together the highs and the lows here. And just a reminder, the commander-in-chief is heading to Martha's Vineyard for his annual vacation. And Seven's own Byron Barnett will be there. You can catch his live report starting this Friday right here on 7 News. Much more ahead here on 7 News this evening. A brazen thief with an eye for fashion. A crook mixed up with nearly a million dollars in jewelry and handmaids. Then at 4.30, a tragedy on the water where we're learning more after a four-year-old drowns in a lake in Blackstone. Right now on 7 News at 5, taking a hard look at letters offered from Whitey Bulger, how one convicted murderer says they're his ticket to freedom. And now we're going to put together the current conditions around the region from the Intellicast current conditions map. There you have it. 78 Football and I will do that for a lot. We have thousands of satisfied customers here at Bed and Bed Leaf Guard. Why don't you call in today at 1 800 Gutter? Now, the secret is the curve with the water goes in, keeps out the leaf pine needles and other debris. It's the only one piece single system. Call in to be one of 50 all winners. And we'll use Intelcaster to put together a couple of more temperature readings here. Oh my! The trait warmer than Las Vegas at. Labor. Ask about zero down, zero interest, and zero payments for 12 full months. And if you call us today here at Minute Man Leaf Guard, dinner for two with your in home evaluation. Let me keep your gutters. And, uh, and I put together the national map, and now it's time for me to get the local conditions around the region here as I go to this previewed weather.gov EDD site, the ex heads data to get my. Weather condition weather temps from around the around the region here, and I will generate all these numbers and put it onto my own map here that I'm going to use for the 5 p.m. weather magician report here. How could they get a 65? Toyota, let's go places. On the next modern day, why don't I run Claire down the wall and you can fill the haircut? That's strange. How could Milford get 65 degrees? Sheer genius. And Claire gets locked out in the cold. Seven on C-156, Comcast 12, 808. Well, 
they say everything's bigger in Texas. Apparently that goes for closets. Now investigators are searching for a thief who stole up to $1 million worth of designer handbags and jewelry from a woman's three-story closet. Seven's Kana Whitworth has the story. That's an eight. You have to see to believe, and after pictures of this space went viral, it became the envy of women around the globe. But it appears the closet and its contents also got the eye of a crook with expensive taste. $80,000 rings, $150,000 watches. I had heirloom pieces from my mother-in-law that has passed away that I'll never get back. Teresa Romer now says she came home Friday night to find someone had gone to her... You know, I got that video idea of putting it together. It's graphics from Andre Bernier from WJW Fox 8 in Cleveland. I watched him put together graphics for his own team, own map. That he presented back in February of 2014. This is how I do it. What a magician's child. There you have it, the finished product. And from now on, I'm going to spend now until 5 p.m. looking at weather models and looking at the latest on Breffa. Plus, look at the newspaper for a little news items and weather items that they can use and look at Google News. One at on a weather magician, 5 o'clock. Stay tuned.